everybody, welcome to Teresa's World. It's Sunday and I've decided to have a sandwich at Silver Hill. So let's get going. Up there is Silver Hill ahead. everybody at Steelbury Hill and I can't help kind of humming the tune um do 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 da 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 do you know the song <laughs> anyway Steelbury Hill um actually just before I got here there was a guy here and he was doing drone footage of the hill and um I'm going to check him out later and um, I'm going to give him a shout out he's called high on you drone boy <laughs> and I'll be interested to see what footage he took of the hill. So I'm going to give you a little bit of information, but Teresa's World is not a history channel. I just tell you something exists. So Silbury Hill is in Wiltshire. It's about what, 15, 20 minute drive for me. So not very far. That's why I had the idea of having a sandwich at Silbury Hill. Let me tell you a little bit then. Silbury Hill is the largest artificial prehistoric mound in Europe, okay? And it was probably built over a short period between about 2470 and 2350 BC. I honestly cannot comprehend how long ago that is. I really can't. Silbury Hill is part of the Avebury World Heritage Site and a site of special interest. So do Google um, Silbury Hill to find out more information. I remember having a picnic on the top of that hill when I was about, probably about, what, 9, 10, 12, something like that. But at that time you could actually walk up the hill and sit on top and look at the view. It's a shame we can't do that now, but it is really important to preserve the hill for other people to enjoy. So I'm now going to go back to the camper and have my sandwich. I'm also going to give um, a couple of people a shout out. Do you know, I don't believe it. I forgot to bring tomatoes. So I've just got um, cheese. Well, at least I've got the butter. Oh, what is the matter with me? See, I'm not in the same mode when I just come out for a few hours. It's just different. And I'm sure people with campers would understand that. You know, just going out for the day isn't like having a week away, is it? It's not like having a, a long weekend where you're kind of like going to really chill out. I believe I forgot the tomatoes. Hmm. Okay, I've got my sandwiches, but before I take a bite of my sandwich, <laughs> I'm going to do these shout outs um, because I really don't want to have like food everywhere. <laughs> this is a shout out for um, Neil and Anna, who have recently picked up a Volkswagen Trident Auto Sleeper. Evidently, they follow my channel um, and, well, hopefully I inspired them to get such an amazing camper. Their friend, Ed, um, contacted me and asked me to give them this shout out. Um, he's got um, an Instagram page called Adventures of Hillary and he's got a camper called Hillary. So, um, to you all, <laughs> I wish you happy travels in your campers and thank you so much for following Trees' World. Um, I really appreciate it. Thank you. Cheers, everybody. I'm going to enjoy my Coke Zero instead of a cup of tea because I was too lazy to put the gas on. A gentleman called Etienne, and I hope I've said that correctly, Etienne, contacted me um, a few weeks ago. Um, he emailed me via my Facebook Treasures World page. He saw my camper um, at Piccadilly campsite which is just outside the village of Laycock 
And by the way, Laycock is my home village and I must do um, a Teresa's World on Laycock one day. Etienne, thank you so much for um, sticking with Teresa's World and checking it out. Um, I'm glad you enjoy the places I visit um, and um, it was just a real surprise that someone in Belgium could be watching a Teresa's World. <laughs> it really was. And um, yeah, it was lovely to hear from you and thank I you so much. I am now going to have my sandwich, everyone. <laughs> And I have to say, I'm going to miss the tomato because I would really prefer tomato in there or at least a pickle. But there we go. Anyway, um, I'm going to say bye bye now. Um, and thank you for watching this um, little video about. Okay, I'm home now. And I just had to look up the song that's been going round and round in my head whilst I was at Silbury Hill. Um, and you know what? It's Peter Gabriel. But he's going up Salisbury Hill, S-O-L-S-B-U-R-Y, not Silbury Hill. <laughs> I always thought he said Silbury Hill. I really did. That's another story in itself. I should look up this hill that he's climbing up <laughs> and find out about that one. Anyway, on that note, I'm wittering. Bye-bye. Jesus world. <laughs> <laughs>